Okay, so I just feel like I just need to put like some behind the scenes context for this video. I'm filming this on the same day that I filmed my Disneyland Paris haul video, which is the day I came back from Disney this morning. I ordered this package, I pre-ordered this package a while ago when it first went up for pre-orders. I think I literally pre-ordered it five, ten minutes after it went up for pre-order. And then it got dispatched two days before I went on my little European tour adventure thing, which you know all about if you follow me on Instagram. And it got delivered whilst I was in Denmark. I got, because I didn't want it sitting outside my house for the week, I got my neighbour to go and collect it and keep it around her house to be safe. And then as soon as I got home, I went and collected it. It's been a long time coming doing this unboxing, but we have another lounge fly. Hello there, my name is Nerd Tori here. How are we? I hope you're all doing well. So, as you can tell by the title of the video, you already know which bag we're unboxing today. And if you know anything about me, you'll know this bag is perfectly suited for me. But in case you don't, let me just give you the lowdown. I'm obsessed with Winnie the Pooh. I don't think that's even a lowdown. I think you just need to click on any of my social medias or look at my pajamas to know that. But the other thing that you might not know about me, um, is I am born during spooky season. I know it's a shock because I'm the least spookiest person you know. I don't actually like Halloween. It does not fit in with my aesthetic. I can never say that word, aesthetic at all. You know me, I'm pink, pastels, girly. Halloween doesn't really suit that. I'm born on 29th of October, so spooky season. I've always kind of, because of being in that season, I always had like a soft spot for pumpkins and like the cutesy side of Halloween, not scary stuff, not the gory icky stuff the cute stuff so when landfly did their um catalogue reveal for the september collection and they were doing starting off their halloween stuff um i saw that they did a tigger crossbody bag with he was like a vampire and he had his vampire cape and some vampire teeth i thought oh that's cute but one crossbodies really aren't for me and i didn't really it was cute but what, not for me then i saw this bag and everything just oh my god i was like <laughs> it just felt perfect for me it's winnie the pooh it's spooky season so my birth season but it doesn't have the scary element I mean, it's winnie the pooh it's not gonna be scary anyway it's got the cutesy like they're trick-or-treating it glows in the dark you will see all about it when i open it so everything about it just set, seemed like it was made for me so that is why we're here today. And I don't think I can keep talking about it any longer, as I just told you. <laughs> it's already been a week since this got delivered, but I literally only came home today, so. I think without further ado, let's just, let's open it. I'm so excited. And just to be completely transparent with you guys, this is from the company Pop Figures. I have worked with them in the past, but I did buy this bag with my own money. But I do have a little discount code for you guys i will leave it here you get 15 percent off this bag or any of their monthly lounge fly releases so literally april may june july august um yeah 15 percent off i'll also leave a link in the description down below for you to go and have a little browse um but yeah just wanted to be completely transparent with you guys I did pay for this with my own little pennies yeah let's open it i'm so excited and i've actually been prepared i've actually got some scissors at the ready i know who is she? She goes on holiday and she becomes prepared for videos. Maybe that means I should go on holiday more often. <laughs> I don't know how I'm going to show you guys like the glow in the dark feature. I might have to turn my lights off. I mean, it's I'm filming this in the af afternoon, so <laughs> I might have to just shut my curtains and turn the lights off so you can see the glow in the dark. The neighbours have got family around in the garden. They're all having a little picnic out on the their garden and like this isn't awkward at all. <laughs> okay, yeah, packaging. We continue, we continue. Put on a show. Okay, and then the thing I always love about pop figures, you get a nice little, I never know what they're called. Are these dust bags? It makes storing them so much easier. And I, when I took my lounge flies to Disneyland Paris with me, it made it keeping them in the car so much easier. Usually there's a black. I really like this, this creamy color. It's nice, I like it. The other thing with pop figures, you always send you a little bag of jelly beans. And if you've watched any of my other videos, you'll know. These will be going straight to my dad. And stickers. <laughs> there it is. Oh my God, it's so cute. <gasps> ah. I'm so excited for this. And also the other kind of different thing with this bag for my collection. If you've watched 
if you know anything about my lounge bike collection or you've watched my unboxings you know i'm more a fan of the cosplay style bags i think i literally only have one all over print bag and that's my christmas park snacks bag that was a long sentence i just prefer the cosplay ones to the all over print but this one is it's an all over print but it's different you'll understand the reveal <gasps> look at it look at it <laughs> Let me just take all the packaging off and we'll be back. Oh my god. Oh my god. Kind of got a bit distracted at the, at the beginning there because um, one of the things some people um, who are big all over print collectors get really particular over the placement of the print which is obviously you can't, something you can't control when ordering online um, and I have known people before to buy multiple bags so then they can decide which placement they prefer and then return all the others. I'm really not too fussed. I like the potluck of where it's going to be. But I do feel like I do absolutely love the placement on this. I mean, look, you've got Pooh in his lion costume front and centre there. We love that. And yeah, Piglet has just made it on there as well. Got Tigger there and Eel there. So yeah, you have got the four main guys on the front. Which I think is what most people are after when they're looking for the all over print on this bag. And then yeah, you've got some sweets and pumpkins. I'm skipping, I've done so many Loungefly reviews, I know my setup of this, why am I skipping stages? I'm just so excited over this. Anyway, let's do a quick little 360 for you and then we'll go through all the deets. It's cute, right? You guys know what I'm going to mention, textures. So the main part of the bag is kind of like your standardy lounge flight material. It has got like a bit of a bumpy texture to it. And I don't know if you can even see it on the bag. I don't even know how to describe it, but it has got, you know, the leathery sort of feel to it. But then on the pouch bit, it is still the same sort of material, but I don't know if I show you sideways if it's gonna... I just know, look how cool that placement of poo is there. <laughs> it's just fit in there, I just noticed that. I don't know how to describe it, but the main pouch is the same as the rest of the bag. But the characters and like the trees and the moon and all of that, it's not like appliqued on, it's not an additional thing, but it is like imprinted off. It's got like a bit of a 3D texture to it. I literally don't know how to describe it to you. It is just like a little risen from it. You can more feel it when you're like wiping your hand over it. I don't think you guys can notice it too much, but that is just a cool little thing. Yeah, so you've got the gang in their Halloween costumes so you've got tigger as a vampire which you can also get as the crossbody bag as well um which pop figures do sell as well you've got eeyore there as a little mummy and he's carrying his little trick-or-treat bag poo as a lion that is so adorable look at his gloves he's got the little paws oh that's so cute and he's got his little pumpkin basket as well and then piglet oh my goodness he's a little witch carrying a big pumpkin and then you've got the little spooky trees in the background. You've got, there you go, you've got some stars in the sky. And the coolest part about this bag, the moon glows in the dark. How cool. Again, I don't know how I'm gonna show you it. I'll see if I turn off my lights and shut the curtains if it'll work. I'll include that now. Okay, I've just shut the curtains, got my bag here. I'm over at the light switch. So let's have a look. Okay, it didn't show up on camera, but I will, it was there. It was very, it wasn't like obviously glowing in the dark, but you could tell it was there. It just couldn't show up on camera. So if I can get better footage of it, I will include it. Um, but it does glow in the dark. It just wouldn't show up for you. I don't know if that worked or not, but that's that. Yeah, and then do you see what I mean by, it's, it's an all over print, but it's different. So the whole main bit of the bag is the all over print, it's all over print on the back as well. But then the front pouch has got it's the little scene on it, which I do really like. And the plaque, I almost skipped over that. Disney lounge fly on this really nice orange with gold detailings. And it's on a black backer, which I do really like that. That is so cute. And not too much to discuss on the back. As I said, it is just the same all over print as the rest of the bag. But there you go, I'll just show you so you can get a better idea. So yeah, you've got all the characters, as well as some sweets. So you've got some lollipops, some little sweetie bar, sweetie candy things. Candy corn. 
I'll be honest, I know majority of my viewers on here are American, so I will just hold my hands up and admit, I've, until, unless, until watching like Disney Channel shows growing up and movies and things like that, and watching my fellow Disney friends on here from America, no idea what candy corn is, <laughs> other than watching it on socials. Um, we don't have it over here. <laughs> I just know it looks like that. I don't have no idea what it tastes like or anything like that. Um, but I know you guys really like it, so... <laughs> just thought I'd admit that, we don't have that over here. Those are sweets, candy corn, lollipops, pumpkins, balloons that look like pumpkins, um, and yeah, and then the characters. So it's quite cool that you get a good overview of it. Then you've got the tags here. It's a bit interesting. You've got the usual tag that comes on your Landfly bag. But then you've got this tag of the bag. Oh, it just says it glows in the dark. That's what that tag is for. It just says it glows in the dark. Also, you can get a matching wallet with this. Um, I can't remember what the design... I think it was this bit, and then it had like this on the back. Um, I don't collect Landfly wallets, but it did look really cute. And the last thing left to do is the lining. I never seem to look at the linings when I'm buying bags. I like the pure, I don't know, surprise of it when I actually buy it. Okay, that's cute. I'm gonna take a bit of the stuffing out for you and then you can see it. I think that'll be enough. There you go, you've got loads. So you've got loads of the lollipops and sweets and pumpkins. But what I really like, you've got a honey pot stuffed filled with more sweets i wonder who was using that trick-or-treating that is so cute so yeah i can't off the top of my head i can't remember how much of the bag was i will leave it here but as i did say i have got a 15 percent off code you can use it is tori 15 all capital letters and that will give you 15 percent off so quite a good saving on this bag i'm pretty sure it is free delivery as well so even more a good deal. As I said, link is in the description. I'm so in love with this. I'm going to Pooh Corner Cafe on my birthday. I have ordered a Winnie the Pooh Halloween dress from Lottie Bounds. When that comes, I will do like an unboxing, probably just on my Instagram. Um, but I'm sure you'll see it on here eventually. And it's gonna go so well with this. I'm so excited to do that outfit. Especially because I've never really done Halloween because it never really fitted me. But now I can do like a Winnie the Pooh thing. I think I can make it work for my cute my cute pink pastels aesthetic without it being scary <laughs> so yeah what do you guys think of this bag i absolutely love it if you guys ordered anything from the september slash halloween loungefly catalog do let me know in the comment section down below did you order this one are you eyeing this one up let me know in the comment section down below if you enjoyed this video please pop that thumbs up button and if you'd like to see more from what don't forget to click subscribe down below and when you're down there don't forget to ding the notification bell email as well you do down there and i'll see you guys next time Bye!